it's Time Scarf 11 with something very special today. This took forever to build and forever to color because I've never made anything like this before. Lego Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Uni's Ouroboros form. My favorite of the Ouroboros forms, except maybe for Mio. Kind of tied between which one is my favorite. But Uni's my favorite character, so I went and made her Ouroboros form. So I've never made a fully built large figure like this before, so I had to learn a lot of things from scratch for what to do to actually put this together. So this is, I have a minifigure head under there and then using a minifigure space helmet for the head. These are tape as usual details like that. And this is also tape. These are flame pieces that I cut to be shaped more correctly. Same with down here. So I have it on this stand because it can't stand up on its own. If anyone wants to see how to build this, I could do a tutorial on it if you ask, but I'm not planning on doing it unless someone asks because it's just going to be very difficult to put back together once I take it apart. Especially because of this, I don't think I could take the ring apart at all because getting that back into position is going to be a nightmare. Getting it in there the first time was hard enough. But if anyone wants to see how to build this, then let me know in the comments and I will eventually get a tutorial out on this. Didn't really put much detail into the back. Hard to keep something this big steady. I don't currently have any plans to make the other Ouroboros forms, but if there's interest in that, then I might consider doing it. I would at least like to try making Mio's maybe, since it would have a similar body shape to Uni's, and I could just base the build off of this one. I'm also considering making her weapon, her other weapon, the Sacred Cannon Talent Art Rifle. For now, the only weapons are just the like wing things that float around her. And everything is movable, I just don't want to bother moving it because then I'd have to get it back into position. So like the legs. These are all articulated, arms are articulated. You can even bend at the waist if you want. Actually, no. Can't bend at the waist because this is blocking it. I forgot that. You can get a very slight bend at the waist, but mostly the part that the ring is attached to is blocking that from happening. So again, if you want to see how to build this, then let me know in the comments and I'll eventually get to making a tutorial on this. If you watch the end, then comment Blossom Dance down below and see you next time. The piece was a bit off.